resiliency uh, and strengthening the resilience of each and every uh, soldier, family member, civilian that serves the United States Army, not only assists in how you deal with the adversity that inevitably each and every person faces as they go through life, uh, is a life skill that will make them uh, stronger and better as a soldier for life. And so I'm absolutely uh, convinced that uh, anything that we can do to strengthen the resiliency of, of those who serve in the United States Army is going to help the nation concurrently. As our soldiers transition back to civilian life, as they continue to be ambassadors for this great profession, uh, the United States Army, uh, the fact of the matter is we don't have the same level of resiliency in every human being uh, in America. And so that has to be adaptive enough to recognize uh, where somebody's developmental skills are not where they need to be and to apply the great resources available to us to help rapidly strengthen that resilience as best we can. That really is the challenge. One size does not fit all. Um, every human being has different needs and uh, having that transparent dialogue between the first line leaders and the individual soldiers is, is a critical variable in ensuring that, that we have the engaged leadership that can help us uh, work on this resiliency as we go forward.